Hello from Molyneux Stadium, where Wolverhampton Wanderers are set to face Chelsea in what promises to be a fascinating clash. Wolves are looking to kickstart their season after a rocky start, while Chelsea are sitting comfortably in third and hoping to keep the momentum going. Wolves will be leaning on Matthias Konha for a spark up front. He's known for his quick feet and ability to turn on a dime, so Chelsea's defense might need more than a little bit of luck to keep up with him. And with the home crowd roaring behind them, Wolves are sure to put up a fight. Chelsea, meanwhile, are starting the season strong under their new system, with Enzo Fernandez orchestrating the midfield. Fernandez plays like he has eyes on the back of his head. No pass is too risky and no angle too tight. Wolves' midfield might feel like they're chasing ghosts if he gets into his groove. Fun fact, Chelsea haven't lost at Molyneux since 2020. Will Wolves end that run or will Chelsea keep their unbeaten streak intact? Get ready for an intriguing battle in Wolverhampton. Hello and a warm welcome from the English West Midlands. We find ourselves at Molyneux. My name is Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board to provide all the analysis is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers taking on Chelsea. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. The initial 11 for Wolves. Well, they're playing with a 5-2-3, as we can see it here. But somebody has to step in to join those two midfield players. It could be one of the fullbacks or it could be one of the centre-halves. So keep an eye out for that. Here's the lineup for Chelsea. Well, it's certainly a back four, but I think we'll see a lot of rotation in midfield. They just need to have a good understanding about when to support the front player and when to drop that little bit deeper. It certainly looks like a 4-5-1 to me. Oh, Stuart, and the match begins. Kukureya. Good technique displayed. Matt Doherty. Jurgen Strand Larsen. Here's Lamina. Doherty. Happy to take on the shot. Really good diving save. Driven in the corner. And that is not going to help the cause. The header well off the mark. Important test this for Wolves after losing against Arsenal. How might this one go, Stuart? Well, away from home, I thought it was a pretty insipid display. Today, they just need to show a bit more ambition going forward. Then they'll get a better performance and a possible outcome. I think a draw is the most likely result. Well, possibilities inside the box. And he takes it on! Well, I must admit, it didn't trouble the keeper to the extent that I thought it might. Mateus Cunha. Jürgen Strand Larsen. Wang Hee-chan. Really 
single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Fernandez. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow, Stuart. What do you think we'll see from him today? Well, Derek, I thought he was brilliant last time out. Scored a couple of goals, but it's his general play. Oh, genuine chance. Oh, a tremendous block. Strong hand on that one. Jürgen Strand Larsen. And Wolves in a position of menace. Ryan Ait Nuri. And teammates to play it to. Oh, moving it nicely. Brilliantly blocked. Given away by Chelsea. A concession of a corner here. Keeper will mind that sort of corner. Madueke. Malo Gusto. Room to roam for Chelsea on the wing. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Juan Hee Chan. Possibilities here. Well, not quite the header he had in mind, and the goalkeeper gobbling that one up. Enzo Fernandez. Palmer. Jackson. And the pass deftly cut out. Wang Hee Chan. Doherty has it. Mateus Cunha. He'll take this on. Well, in actual fact, it ended up being a simple claim for the keeper. Enzo Fernandez. Kukureya. Mikhailo Mudrik. Jean Rickner Belgarde. Nuri. Mateus Cunha. Here's Lamina. Matt Doherty. Caicedo. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Moises Caicedo. Noni Madueke. It's really opening up positively for Chelsea. Shaping to shoot, a gift for any goalkeeper. An alert intervention. Good work from Wolves to win it back. Jürgen Strand Larsen. Dies for goal! And he's kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Who can he pick out? Half-hearted clearance. High degree of difficulty to hit it on the volley like that, and it was close. Well, his skill level is so high, you're absolutely right. That's a great effort on the volley.
Mudrik. Mihailo Mudrik. Pulls it back. That's a good looking pass. And he's gone for power. So close to finding the net. Lemina. Jürgen Strand Larsen. Jean Rickner Bellegarde. Matt Doherty. Here's Lemina. And the ruling is offside here. Kukureya. Noni Madueke. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. Can he play it in? Is this the moment? And effectively parried away by the keeper. Belgarde. Mosqueira. And here's Cunha. Nuri. Mateus Cunha. Well, good run and good ball control. Lemina! Strong hand on the ball. Caicedo. Kukureya. Mudrik. And time is up as far as the first half is concerned here in the West Midlands. Into the second half then. And these two sides are locked together. Just can't really choose between them at the moment. Matt Doherty. Belgarde. Mateus Cunha. Gusto. Noni Madueke. Now the pass not finding its target. Mateus Cunha. And Wolves looking dangerous. But timely defending when it mattered. And we have more live Premier League action coming up for you soon on EA TV. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers facing Nottingham Forest. Crossing possibilities. A very effective clearance. Madueke. Gusto. Oh, good looking run. That is tackling of the highest order. Well, standing off them here, aren't they being too passive? Nice looking move, this. Reading it well. Palmed away by the keeper. Mosqueira. Jean Rickner Bellegarde. Mateus Cunha. Nuri. Well, probably a fair assessment of his first half's work would be a mixed bag. And it certainly wasn't his best half of football. He was slightly off the pace and he gave the ball away too easily. Spectacular save. Top-class goalkeeping.
trying to deliver it accurately and swept out of there might lead to a chance but a crucial intervention inside the box so a half an hour remaining Ryan Ait Nuri and we have more live Premier League action coming up for you soon on EA TV. It's Chelsea facing Crystal Palace. Oh, that's a really good run. Real chance. And a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it. And now they've been rewarded. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder and his movement so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. And away they go again. What effect will that goal have on Chelsea? We're going to find out. Palmer. Mudrik. And Chelsea looking dangerous. Credit due, a good intervention. Palmer. Mudrik. This looks more than decent. Can he finish? And keeping it out. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Now sending it in. And knocked out of there. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. Jackson on the ball. Excellent defending. Gomes. into the final 20 minutes Jürgen Strand Larsen Lemina Doherty has it Mateus Cunha Moises Caicedo. Noni Madueke. That's a good ball. Attending to his defensive chores. Mateus Cunha. Beautifully weighted ball. But how well he did to react in that manner. Jackson on the ball. Moises Caicedo. Madueke. Well, they're behind, but they might be onto something here. Well, I think a classic commentator's curse just then. Couldn't make the ideal pass. able to cash in from here and no degree of difficulty for the goalkeeper Mikhailo Mudri Moises Caicedo 
Gusto. The onus is on Chelsea to be positive with time running out. And now waiting to pounce. What late excitement. And the match is level. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Well, they needed that, and so did he. Just look at the manager's relief there. On the offensive, is there to be late excitement? A fine reading of the situation. Jackson on the ball. Palmer. Oh, what a top-notch pass. Opportunity here. Oh, and it goes! And that is simply vivacious on the volley. Take a bow. Take several bows. The degree of difficulty was high, but you wouldn't know it. What a skill to possess. Absolutely marvellous. Dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Tote Antonio Gomes. In possession, Dawson. Jürgen Strand Larsen. Well, the electronic board showing three additional minutes. Chasing this game, desperate for a leveller. Obvious offside. Fernandez. Dangerous looking attack. Well, that's a really top notch piece of defending. So, the final whistle, and what we can say officially now is that Chelsea have picked up maximum points from this fixture. Well, Derek, what a good finish to the game that was. They just wore down the opposition, and in the end, they got their reward. That's a really good win for them. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, he should be pleased with himself today because he performed really well. He scored a good goal and they won the game. An excellent day all round. And the match begins. It's not the gifts under the tree It's the love we give that sets us free Doherty and Every smile and every cheer The spirit of Christmas draws us near It's not what we give, but what we give That's the magic in the life we live oh, the joy of He's driven in the corner part. To see the glow in a loved one And that is not going to help the cause The header as eyes for goal half-hearted clearance pulls it back that's a good looking pass and he's gone for power so close to finding the net Every song we've known this feeling all along. It's the giving, not the things we keep, that makes the season so deep. Oh, oh the joy of giving is the sweetest part. Real chance.
chance. And a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it, and now they've been rewarded. This looks more than decent. And now waiting to pounce. What late excitement. Opportunity here. The ball is rolling. We're underway. Joe Linton. Sean Longstaff. Marcus Tavernier. The crowd encouraging him to take it on. Ryan Christie. Max Ahrens. That looks decent, making progress here. Joe Linton. A chance to get in behind with that. Decent looking attack, this. Nice bit of defending there to put it out for a throw. Tino Livramento. And the flag's up. Offside the call. Longstaff. Weighted beautifully. And it's cleared away from goal. Joe Linton. Bruno Gimaraes. They are sitting a bit too deep here. It was a great chance, but great defending too. They're being afforded too much space here. Put into the middle. And that one is got away. And it's in. It's no longer goalless. There's the opener. And the... the restart, off we go again. Plenty of space to attack now. Surely the equaliser. And that is a quality bit of goalkeeping. Sean Longstaff. Jacob Murphy. Space now to get a crossover. Gimaraj. This is a lovely spell of possession. But maybe one past too many and they've lost it. Gimaraj. And the pass is incomplete. Nicely won. What a chance. Oh, top quality goalkeeping to deny what looked a likely goal. Max Ahrens. Lewis Cook. A move of real promise developing. And that's where it ends. Finds himself with space now. Crucial defending. And out of play it goes for a throw-in. Ryan Christie. That's not a bad-looking ball. Well, that's how to clear it. Can someone attack this? Oh, it's been missed. It looked a good opportunity, that. Lovely weighted pass. Tino Livramento. Jacob Murphy. Now, this might be promising. And the referee brings the game to a close with the points going back with the visitors.